Welcome back to Let's Play Ares Extinction Agenda EX. I'm Burning Dog Face, and this is back in level 1. Because I wanted to check out this hole in the ceiling I could never quite reach. Well, yeah, there's definitely something up there. Well, that was pretty straightforward. Upgrade unlocked to the laser reactor! Nice. Wrong one first. Mm. Fires even faster and does more damage. Mm. Feel a bit strange that I didn't find an upgrade to the Zytron Blaster first, but you know, I'm pretty fond of this gun, so. We only have 130 max health, so... Let's invest in this one first. Aw, uh, yeah! Bow your head! That guy has shields. What the hell? Uh... What the fuck am I supposed to do about that? Okay, nuts to that. I'm still recording because there's another part that I wanted to check out. This one would actually escape my notice. It was pointed out to me by my good friend Ronan Drake. Yeah, I know he's there. Sorry, I just realized I forgot to start my timer. How embarrassing. Yes, it's just over here, actually. Apparently I've never thought to go all the way over here even though there's a door. I could have sworn I'd come in from this direction once, but... I don't know how to get through that. Well, I'm gonna keep collecting, uh, material. And then I'll see you on the other side of this jump cut. Okay. I got a C on the last run, by the way. Yes, I remember now. Press B to use plasma shock against electric fans. Dash through them while they are short circuited. Oh, hey, new guys. I don't like them at all. Fuck these. Fuck this. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh yeah, that reminds me. I was, uh... I did a little bit of digging around last night. Shit. And while I couldn't... I still couldn't find any indication what, uh... A-R-E-S is supposed to stand for, other than looking cooler than just writing the word Ares. I don't really think it stands for anything. Uh, I did learn a few things about the original game. 
Like, uh... In the original non-EX version of this game, there were three different types of materials. If I just jump onto those, is it gonna bring me down and kill me? Uh, might as well find out. Yep. Well, now I know better. Oh, not this shit again! Yeah. Original Ares, there were three different kinds of materials. Uh... I don't know that they, uh, had individual names, but they look different. Like red ones, blue ones, and uh, I don't know, green ones? Yeah, I remember the color the third one was. And instead and instead of the system in this game, you would you would use these materials to craft stuff. So it's like Oh hey. Oh, okay. Hooray! I wonder if that's how I'm supposed to deal with those shields. Yeah, okay. No, look at that. Oh. I think that door is broken. Shield Breaker. Oh, that reminds me. I got a thing last time. Uh, shield Breaker. Achievement unlocked. Break the enemy's shield with plasma, shield, plasma shock or knockdown. Sorry, lockdown. But that didn't make any sense. Come on. Also got achievement unlocked. Break the shell. Beat Zypher Pod with Ares. Oh, that is totally just a background element. Okay. Zytron Walker LA. A lightly armored version of the Zytron Walker pieced together with various junk by Zytron. I was kind of wondering about that. Yeah, this is the one that was the mini-boss in the first level. I guess these are the ones who have just been showing up. Hey, he, the first one killed me once, so I don't know why they downgraded. Oh, great, good duck under that. Drink. I see what I was supposed to do there. Hmm. Damn. 
first time I blow up some explodey boxes, and I was probably supposed to leave them in place. Oh, for God's sake. Ha! Ah. Ha. Ah. Well, that was still worth it. Yeah, I saw a turret and, uh, one of those floaty guys at the first level after I turned off the, uh, camera. I'm starting to say, uh... I didn't look very far into it, because I didn't want to get any spoilers. But, uh, from what I saw... You used your three different types of materials to craft repair kits, and then one of them was consumed every time you hit the, uh, repair skill. Way I want to go. I guess I'll go. Oh, I guess I'll go this way. What is this? That was bullshit. Blowing up on the underside of the platform. do anything, is there... yeah. So it's like... Ooh, was close. Twenty of these, fifty of these, and thirty of these do make one repair kit. And then one of those gets used up every time you, uh, push the button. So instead of that, they simplified it for the EX version, saying, you know, you know what, there's only one kind of materials, we'll just use it as, we'll just use it like a currency, and, uh, you use a hundred of them up every time you use the repair skill. Oh, god damn it. Fine. Speaking of which... Wow! This level's kind of a bitch. My God! Nope, I don't agree with this at all. They give you that one automatically. with the mini-bosses in this game being such a pain in the ass. Oh, God damn it! At least there's no loading screen. Apparently the original game also had a better intro cutscene. Well, I say apparently, but I saw it with my own eyes. That actually opens the scene on the station. Which isn't called Mino Station, it's just shown being a space station, and it says that it's somewhere in the junk sector. Uh...
Oh, god damn it. So sure I was going to make that one, I didn't, uh, whatever. Um, yeah, it shows, oh, the, there's the station. And, uh, wow. All right, that one is me. That one is all me. The station gets hit with uh, an unidentified object that pierces the hull. And then suddenly robots come onto the uh, command bridge and just smoke everyone. Then it shows, uh, Dr. Julia Carson's original SOS message, talking about how the robots have all gone berserk. Oh, fuck! I didn't mean to hit the L button! Well, I really want that thing. Maybe if I get it, I'll keep it even if I die. So I won't let keeping such things in mind as, uh, you know, survival keep me away from that goal. Let's see, do I still have an upgrade available for Solar Strike? Yes! Nice. Okay. That's better. Alright, that was me. Um, yeah, cut the... When the SOS message cuts out, it shows that it's been Ares watching this. And, uh, some guy on a screen is telling him to rescue the, uh... Fuck. To rescue the hostages. What about the, ro the infected robots, sir? They can rot for all I care! Your only priority is the hostages! And maybe a little bit of, uh, inorganic racism going on there? There's no consideration at all given to the robots that, uh... Oh, shit. Ares didn't seem offended, though. He's just like, okay, sure, whatever. Oh, and, uh... The very first line in the first level is different. Valkyl actually introduces herself. I'm Valkyl, the, uh, support satellite for this mission. Which makes me wonder if she actually has a physical body at all? Fuck. Okay, take a drink. Fine, jump cut. Well, that wasn't too bad. Threw on the other gun to uh, make it lighter. Oh, good! I'm, I get to murder you already. Okay. Suck a fat one. Ah, uh, my health is nothing. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, that drone did something to you, Ares. And whatever it is, it's dismantling your armor at the molecular level. Query, recommended course of action? 
There's a drone repair bay not far from your current location. I'm going to try activating it remotely. What are you waiting for? RUN! Oh fuck, he had shield. I guess that was just bad luck. Fuck you. Bomber. A flying security robot developed by the Aztai that has a deadly bomb built into it. When an intruder is spotted, it will charge it in its direction at full speed. Phew, that was too close! Hurry up and get in! Whoa! Prototype suit. There! All better. I've also augmented your suit's capabilities using schematics I found in the drone bay's data banks. Maneuverability and overall combat efficiency should be greatly enhanced. I do not feel any different. Oh, it's my pleasure, Ares. Please, there's really no need to thank me. I mean, anyone could have gained access to a military-grade network, reprogrammed it with a complicated, intricate procedure, and coded improvements to your native architecture at the same time. Do not sell yourself short, Valkyl. No one could have achieved the same results without your advanced training. <sighs> Maybe I should have let that nano-plague eat that tin brain of yours. Go on, you better get moving. Prototype suit makes you invulnerable while, dam while dashing, and deals damage to the enemies in your path. Also, I look really goddamn cool. Well, seems like a good spot to call it. Oh, one last thing that I remember. Uh, out of curiosity, I tried to find out, without spoiling anything, whether Taurus was in the original game or not. And I got exactly one hit. It was in the description of somebody else's Let's Play of the uh, original game. It was on the playlist description. It said that uh, Ares is accompanied by uh, the, the support satellite Valkyl and the assault squad Taurus. So apparently he was in the original game in some fashion. He just wasn't a playable character, or probably, or apparently as Im as big a character as he is here, where he was included in the opening cutscene and all. Uh, that being said, I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Ares Extinction Agenda EX. Freshly kitted out with new duds. It's time to keep moving and kick some more ass. Later! <laughs>